All right, let's make some video games. Let's go open up this Unity editor. Oh, God, gee, oh, it's so bright. Ah, I can't even deal with this. Hello, everybody, and welcome to today's video. I'm gonna be showing you how we can turn the Unity editor into the dark mode, just like this, completely for free. And this isn't using any tricks or any gimmicks or anything illegal or anything like that. This is all 100% real because Unity has officially released the dark theme available to all users. And make sure you stick around to the end of the video because I'm gonna be telling you the number one thing that you need to do after enabling dark mode in the Unity editor. So you just need to be on the latest versions of Unity. And if you do need any assistance on how to install the latest version of Unity, check out this video that I made that goes over how to use the Unity Hub and it's gonna show you how to install the latest versions of Unity. All right, so once you're up to date on the latest and greatest versions, the steps are pretty simple. You just go up to Edit and Preferences and then you see the Editor theme. Right now, if it's set to Personal, all you need to do is just change that to professional and then within a couple seconds it switches right on over to the dark mode just like that now i wouldn't be surprised if unity changes this naming scheme from personal and professional over into like a light and dark theme um, but again this is a brand new addition for them to release the dark mode for everyone who's running a personal edition of unity so now that you have the dark theme enabled in the unity editor what is the number one thing that you need to do now that is go make a game. So now you have no excuse. You know, you can't say that your eyes are hurting or anything like that. You have your dark theme. It is time for you to go make a game. Of course, if you don't know how to make a game, there are plenty of tutorials online. I've even made one that goes in depth on how to make a game front to back. It's a whole comprehensive tutorial that shows you everything that you need to know to go from having a complete blank Unity project just like this to a full finished project just like the one shown behind me. So anyways, that's gonna wrap up today's video. I hope that you found it helpful. If you did, I really appreciate it if you hit that like button. Also feel free to subscribe to the channel for lots more videos on Unity video game development. Of course, if you have any questions for me or suggestions for future videos, feel free to leave those down in the comment section below. But I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day and I'll see you in the next one. stupid.